Welcome to the second instalment of the Reclaiming the Master Quest Cape playlist. Yes, I've changed the name of this series. I'm Hunter Esk or the Runescape Lorehound, and today we'll be covering the Animalingual Achievement. Before that though, I would recommend you take a look at the suggestion card which will pop up now. This playlist contains guides which cover all of the other AMQC requirements currently in the game, except after the close, which was covered in part 1 of this series. For these videos, as usual, I'm going to assume you have the quest point cape. I will attempt to include the quests, skills, and any other requirement you need for each achievement. In addition, these video guides are also made to be Iron Man friendly. With that, let's reclaim that master quest cape by covering Animalingual. The requirement we are going to look at today is the Animalingual achievement, and this is worth 15 rune score. You must fully upgrade the Cramulet. To do this, you need to have completed the quests Restless Ghost, Monkey Madness, Inacra's Lament, Ishlarin's Little Helper, A Tale of Two Cats, Back to the Freezer, and Gower Quest. You also need to have at least partially completed the Do No Evil quest, up to the point where the Cramulet is created. As usual, I would recommend having completed Do No Evil fully. Being honest, the most difficult part of this task is actually completing the quests themselves, because if you are a hoarder, like myself, it is likely that you will have all the required amulets within your bank. For me, I only had to add the Crocspeak and Cabbage Speak amulets to my Cramulet, which were in my bank, to complete the task. However, I am going to include all the amulets you need to fill the Cramulet and how to reclaim any that you may have destroyed. The amulets you will need to add to the Cramulet are the Ghost Speak, Monkey Speak, Camulet, Enchanted Cat Speak, Croc Speak, and Cabbage Speak amulets. We are now going to cover how to reclaim any lost amulets, starting with the Ghost Speak. If you have destroyed the Ghost Speak amulet, you should go and visit Father Ernie in his lone house in Lumbridge Swamp. You can tell him you're there to repossess his house if you wish, because I always do because it's funny and I'm a jerk. But to reclaim the amulet, ask Father Ernie for a replacement. He will scold you for losing the amulet, but should give you his convenient spare. He will also tell you if it is on your cramulet, and refuses to give you a spare. Next, we move on to the Monkey Speak amulet. If you've destroyed this amulet, sadly it is a bit of a pain to retrieve. The amulet is created during the Monkey Madness quest by giving the Gnome Mage, Zooknock, the following items. Monkey Dentures, a Monkey Speak amulet mould, and a gold bar. Zooknock will then give you an enchanted bar. Find Zooknock in the top right corner of a dungeon in Southern Ape Atoll as seen on screen and give him the required items. You take a surprising amount of damage in this dungeon, so be warned even if you are high level. However, if you need to gather the required items first, remember your Monkey Grigri before you teleport to Ape Atoll, preferably the Ninja Monkey Grigri for speed. To get a Monkey Speak Amulet Mold, visit Hamab's Crafting Emporium and purchase one for 10 gold coins. Gold bars can be bought from the Grand Exchange or created fairly easily if you're an Iron Man. I doubt though that as an Iron Man you would have destroyed this amulet. To get some Monkey Dentures, Search the dark brown crates in the warehouse, south of the sword stall on Ape Atoll, which I'm showing you on screen. Switching back to Zooknox dungeon now, give him the required items and he'll give you an enchanted bar. With Zooknox Enchanted Bar in your inventory, find the dungeon below the Temple of Marimbo in Ape Atoll. You teleport into this temple when you use the Ape Atoll teleport. and use your enchanted bar on the magical flame along with the monkey speak amulet mold to create the amulet. Finally, 
using a ball of wool on the amulet will string it together. So to return to the Grand Exchange and buy one if you haven't already, or if you're an Iron Man, you're going to have to spin one. Thankfully, reclaiming the Camulet is a little less annoying. Go to the Bandit Camp Lodestone and visit Inacra's Temple to the south. Inside the temple is Lazim, who you can reclaim your Camulet from. You will have to go up a few ladders to reach him on the top floor. He, as everybody else has been, will be pleased to see you. It is unlikely that you would need to reclaim an unenchanted Catsby amulet, but I've covered it here for completeness. But if you do need to reclaim it, speak to the Sphinx in Sofanum with a cat or kitten following you. You will need the unenchanted Catsby amulet to make the enchanted Catsby amulet. I say that you'll be unlikely to destroy it just because it's used so often. For the enchanted version which is needed for the task, take your newly acquired unenchanted Catspeak amulet to Hild in Burthorpe, who will enchant the amulet for you at a cost of 5 death runes. To reclaim the Crocspeak amulet from Back to the Freezer, you can either go to May's quest caravan next to the Varrock Lodestone if you have put 150 quest points into the hub reward track, or you can visit Dundee in Polnivniak. Here. Do not talk to Dundee and Hetz Oasis as you will not be able to reclaim this amulet from him at that location for some odd reason. Finally, to reclaim the Cabbage Speak amulet, you can also go to Maze Quest Caravan after putting 150 quest points into the hub reward track, or you can visit Andrew at the Life Altar by using the Disc of Returning to teleport to the behind the scenes pub and then entering the portal with the greenery around it. He will also give you a replacement. To do the actual task, have all amulets in your inventory. First, use the Ghost Speak and Monkey Speak amulet together to create the Cramulet, and then use the remaining four amulets on the Cramulet to receive the fully upgraded version, and the task should pop up as complete. Congratulations on completing the Animalingual achievement and reclaiming that Master Quest Cape. It is nice to see that Jagex are tying up some loose ends here, as I remember trying to use the Crocspeak amulet on the Cramulet when it first came out, and was disappointed I couldn't do so. Thanks so much for watching this guide, and I hope it helped you. 
If you have any questions, leave me a comment and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Have a great day everybody, and see you later.